اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ویلکم ٹو دا سیونتھ کلاس آف دا قرآن ریسیٹیشن کورس اینڈ ٹو ڈے وی ول انشاءاللہ ریوائز دا تجوید رولز لرن سو فا آئی ایم یور ڈے ٹیچر فار ٹو ڈے اینڈ آئی ول بی اسسٹڈ بائی دا ٹیچنگ اسسٹنٹ ایز ویل ایز دا سپورٹ ٹیچرز انشاءاللہ Today, we also have a girls from Al-Hafizun, from the 11 years age group. These are girls who are memorizing the Holy Quran along with the academic studies, mashallah. Now, um, just to remind all the participants, all the students, if you're not logged in with your correct ID, could I please request you to sign in again with the correct ID that was emailed to you? Otherwise, you will be put into the waiting room and it will just miss out on your class. Okay, now let's start our class with prayers. Could I request the support teacher to unmute a student, please? Assalamu alaikum. Can I request G4410 to come on the mic, please? G4410, assalamu alaikum. G4410, assalamu alaikum. Uh, okay, let me get that. Assalamu alaikum. Not responding. Shall we pick another student? Assalamu alaikum. Faikum prayers, please. Faikum salam. Hello. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you well. Oh. I start? Could please start. Yes, please. Start okay. with Dawes and Tasmiya. A'udhu billahi minashay. بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ربنا انہنا آمنا فاقفل لنا ذنوبنا وقنا عذاب النار Our Lord, we do believe. Forgive us, therefore, our sins and save us from the punishment of the fire. Jazakallah. Jazakallah. Okay, could we now have another student to recite the hadith? Could I request G4416 to unmute their mic? G4416, assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah. A'uzu billahi min ash-shaytanir rajim. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. اللهم صل على محمد وعلى آل محمد كما صليت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد اللهم بارك على محمد وعلى آل محمد كما باركت على إبراهيم وعلى آل إبراهيم إنك حميد مجيد عن عثمان رضی اللہ عنہ قال رسول اللہ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم خیرکم من تعلم القرآن و علم حضرت عثمان بن عفان رضی اللہ عنہ نریٹس دیٹ دا ہولی پرافٹ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم سیٹ دا بیسٹ امنگ یو از دا ون ہو لرنس دا قرآن اینڈ ٹیچز اٹ 
البخاري جزاك الله جزاك الله well done. Okay, now could I request another student to, re to read the Malfuzat? And G4422. G4422, Assalamu alaikum. G4422, Assalamu alaikum. Uh, let me get another student, uh, G4423. G4423, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum, Assalamu alaikum. Could you please read the Malfuzat? Yeah. Saying of Prophet Messiah, peace be upon him. Um, we do not issue a rule that only the translation of the Holy Quran. Oh, start, okay, sorry yeah. to interrupt you. Could you please start with uh, Tasmiya? Okay. With Bismillah. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajim. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. We do not issue a rule that only the translation of the Holy Quran should be read. This invalidates the miracle of the Quran. Whoever says, this does not want the Quran to remain in the world. On the contrary, we even say that the prayers that the Prophet, peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, asked for. They should also be read, they, they should also be read in Arabic. Others who have their own needs, etc., should be asked only in their own language, except for the pure prayer. One person said, your Majesty, in the Hanafi religion, it is considered sufficient to read only the translation. He said, if it is the religion of Imam Azam, then it is his fault. Jazakallah. Jazakallah. Okay, so now could I please request the support teacher to go through the quiz questions? Okay, assalamu alaikum everyone. Okay, the first question is uh, Flesh of which animal is forbidden to eat? A. That which dies by itself. B. That which has been strangled. C. That which dies by fall. Or D. All of them. Uh, could I request the ST to pick a student to answer this question? Assalamu alaikum. I would like to request G4467 to unmute. G4467. Yep. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Uh, is it D, all of them? Jazakallah for your answer. Let's see the what the correct answer is. That's right. D, all of them. Jazakallah. Jazakallah. And can I request the next question? So the next question is, which woman is mentioned by her name in the Holy Quran? A, wife of Pharaoh. B, wife of Prophet Lut, a.s. C, wife of Prophet Noah, a.s. Or D, daughter of Hazar Imran. Could I request another student? Um, can I request G4473 to unmute? G4473. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum, G4473. Could I get another student? Yeah, uh, G4417. G4417, Assalamu alaikum. Oh, um, I think they've just left. G4416. G4416, Assalamu alaikum. Oh, Assalamu alaikum. I think D. D, okay. D. Jazakallah. Let's see. Yes, that's right. The correct answer is D, daughter of Hazar Imran. Jazakallah. Jazakallah. Okay, so the next. Which narration is called Ahsan al-Qasas in the Holy Quran? 
A, narration of Prophet Jesus, alayhi salam. B, narration of Prophet Joseph, alayhi salam. C, narration of Prophet Moses, alayhi salam. Or D, narration of Prophet Jonah, alayhi salam. Could I request a student to answer? Um, G4435. G4435. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Um, actually, I don't know. Uh, do you want to try? By uh, okay. Um, uh, or is that a bit hard? Um, okay, that's fine. I can. Yeah, ask. I really don't know. Um, it's okay, Jazakla. Uh, can I ask I another know. student to answer this? Yeah, um, can I please request G4474? G4474. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Narration, uh, C, narration of Prophet uh, Musa. Jazakallah for your answer. Let's see which is the right one. It is B, narration of Prophet Joseph alayhi salam. Uh, but Jazakallah for your trying. Okay. Jazakallah. So the next question is, which animal is referred as a sign, ayah of Prophet Saleh alayhi salam? Is it A, horse, B, cow, C, she, camel, or D, lamp? Can I request another student? Can I please request G4472 to unmute, please? G4472. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Is it C? Okay, Jazakallah. Let's check if that's right. Yes, that's yes. right. The correct answer is C, she camel. Jazakallah. And well done. Thank you. Okay, so the next question is, which surah of the Holy Quran contains most Arabic alphabets in its name? Is it A, Surah Bani Israel? B, Surah Al-Humaza? C, Surah Al-Baqarah? Or D, Surah al could I request another student, please? Uh, can I request G4409 to unmute, please? G4409. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Um, I think it's B, Surah Al-Baqarah. Uh, Surah Al-Baqarah, C. Okay. Jazakallah for your answer. Let's see. It's A, Surah Bani Israel. But Surah. well done for trying. So that's it for the quiz. Jazakallah, everyone. Okay, Jazakallah, and well done for the quiz. Okay, now let's start with some revision of the rules that we've learned so far. Now, could I please request um, the support teacher to unmute a student, please? Uh, yes, uh, can I request G4401 to come on the mic? Asalaamu Alaikum. Wa Alaikum Asalaam, how are you? Alhamdulillah, fine, how are you? Alhamdulillah, could you please recite uh, the first box? Yeah. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم كتب ففزع مثل Good, well done. So each of the strikes, could you please tell me how many seconds do you have to prolong these? One second. Why do you think that's one second? Uh, because it's uh, just Fataha, Kasra and Lama. Yes, yeah, so in red, we've got the Ba. Mm. In, uh, above the Ba, we've got the Fata, and then the Kasra, Z, and then the Lu. The yeah. Ma. Yeah. yeah, good. Well done. It's just one second. Well done. Good. Right. Okay. And then could I request uh, the support teacher to unmute two students, please? 
Okay. Uh, could I request G4449 to come on the mic? And could I request G4405 to come as well? Okay, Jazakila. Um, could I request G4449 to recite the second box? And could I request G4405 to listen and maybe spot a few mistakes if uh, the recitation consists of mistakes? And then maybe you can just tell me where the recitation went wrong. So G4449, could you please start the reciting? G4449, Assalamualaikum. I think they haven't unmuted. Let me check another student. Uh, could I request G4423 to come on the mic? G4423, Assalamualaikum. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullah. And G4405, are you on the mic as well? Yes, Assalamualaikum. Welcome, Sam. Okay, perfect. So, G4423, could you please start reciting? And G4405, you listen carefully then. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alam tara. Alam yajal tanhituna man amana rabbun ghafurun. Okay, Jazakallah. So G4405. Any mistakes? Pardon? Did you hear any mistakes? Um, yes, just one uh, mistake that I could find. Um, you know this, where it says alam, she didn't prolong it, prolong it for like two, is it, oh, she didn't do the nil, nil sound for the alam. Okay. Nil. I see, okay. Now for this one, we don't need the nasal sound. So I couldn't hear any mistakes. That was all vowel. Um, and uh, you've also, Paid attention on the elongation, the two seconds. So you've prolonged two for two seconds. Well done. Brilliant. Okay. Jazakallah to both of you. Now, could I request uh, the support teacher to unmute one student, please? Uh, yes. Uh, G4460. Jazakallah. G4460. Assalamu this okay. Could you recite the first box? Yeah. Bismillah <clears throat> Jazakallah. Could you tell me whether you were paying attention on some rule here? I try to because there is a vertical um, uh, pata on the uh -huh. la, and then um, there's a uh, karizavar. I mean, sorry, I don't know how to say that in English, but it's like karizavar underneath the alif. So, ila fihim. Good. And then there is one uh, ulti page is like long vowel. So I have to prolong it for like two seconds. Good. Well done. So on the so vertical enough. strokes, on the vertical fatha, vertical kastra and vertical tama, yeah. we have to prolong for two yeah. seconds. Brilliant. Jazakallah. Jazakallah. Could I request the support teacher to unmute another student, please? Uh, yes. G four four five eight. Okay. G four four five eight. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. 
Here comes Dan. Could you please recite uh, the next box? A'uzu billahi minash shaitanir rajim. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Utina nuhi ha. Jazakallah. And can you tell me what was the rule that you had to pay attention at during the recitation? Uh, during the recitation, there is a rule with wow with skun, ya with skun, and alif with skun. So we have to um, uh, we have to um, say the word in the two second counts. So that's why. Yes. So we have the vowel with the sakun. However, before the vowel, we've got the dhamma. Yeah. Dhamma. So when yes. the vowel sakun is preceded by the dhamma, we have to prolong for two seconds. Two seconds. Similarly, if the ya the, yeah. with the sakin is yeah is uh, preceded with the kasra then we have to prolong with two seconds yeah. and um similarly if we had a alif we would have done that with the alif madda so yes these are the rules second elongation well done jazakallah jazakallah okay could i request the support teacher to unmute two students please Okay, uh, could I request G4435 to come on the mic? And can I request uh, G4410 to come on the mic as well? So G4435, assalamu alaikum. Okay, I would like you to listen carefully when G4410 will be reciting. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum Salaam. G4410, could you please start reciting the last box on the screen? Okay, shall we start with that? Wasn't this me? Okay. Oh, I think it was okay. Okay. So, what was the rule that, uh, that the student was paying attention at during the recitation? Um, noon mushadat and the gunna. Yes. So, when we've got me mushadat and noon that we should be pronouncing these with a nasal sound, which should be for two seconds. Okay, Jazakallah. Okay, so now let's move on. And could I request um, the support teacher to unmute another student? Uh, yes. Uh, G4455. Assalamu alaikum. Salam. Uh, could you please um, tell me the ID again? I had G44 and then? 55. Five. Five, five. Could you please confirm? 55. Five. Okay. So G four four five five. Yeah, assalamu alaikum. Could you please Hi. recite the first box, please? Auzu billahi shaitan rajim. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Ar-Rahman 
الرحيم المالك القدوس السلام المؤمن Okay, Jazakallah. Could you recite uh, the first box only again? Huwallahu wallazi la illahu illahu wa Can I say it again, please? Yeah, okay. So here we need to practice again. Okay. Sorry, I couldn't hear you. Could you repeat that, please? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I did, uh, I did listen to that one. That's fine. Yeah, okay. So what we have to um, improve on here is the highlighted bits. Here we've got um Rahim. We've got So here again we have a thick sound because. The Lamu uh, Jalala, or as we had last um, last week, we have to pronounce this one with a thick sound if it is preceded by a fatha, especially in the word Allah. Oh, yeah. So, hu yeah. And then we've got a um, vertical fatha as well, so we need to prolong for two seconds. Hu wallahu. Hu wallahu. Good. And then here we haven't got a, a shadda on the lam, so it will only be for two seconds, but without a connection. So it will be la ilaha, la ilaha, la ilaha. Yeah, okay, jazakallah. Mm -hmm. And could you recite the second last box as well? Al salamu. Okay, so again, the lam here is a silent letter because the um, the shadda is not on the lam, so it will be pronounced as as-salamu, as, because as the shadda is good. Well done, brilliant. Jazakallah. Okay, could I request a support teacher to admit another student now? And G4414. Okay, Jazakallah. G4414. Assalamu alaikum. Ji, yeah, assalamu alaikum. Okay, could you start reciting the second rule, please? Uh, from Asana or? Uh, no, the second row from. Okay. Um, yeah. Take care. So it's Al Al Muhimin. Oh, no, sorry. Al Muhiminu. And then start with that was Good. Jazakallah. Let's have a look at the first box here. Yeah. This it's one would be pronounced as Al Muhaymin. Al Muhayminu. Okay, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, Al Muhaymin. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Any idea what's the rule that we have to pay attention at? It was so, covered because... last. It was yeah, it's a, it's a fat, uh, the before the. Uh, jazam it's not the kasra so we don't have to prolong it no no we don't have to um prolong the fatha on yeah but we've got something what is it what's the rule any ideas al muhaymin why are we pronouncing it as hain okay we're not from the throat it's a uh, highest normal huh i'm not sure okay yeah so we have we've got the soft elongation because We've got a Yalin Haimin, yeah? Take care. Haimin is a soft conversation. Jazakallah. Okay, Jazakallah. I think we can do the next rule as well. Could I request the support teacher to unmute two students, please? Uh, yes. Uh, could I request G4433 to come on the mic? And K4. 
can I request uh, G4444 uh, to come on the mic as well? Okay, Jazakala. Okay, G4433, could you listen carefully whilst G4444 is reciting? A'uzu billahi min ash-shaytani r-rajim. Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim. Al-Musawwiru, al-Ghaffaru. Ek minute, mein apna hand niche kar lu. Upar se aata hai. Al-Qahharu, al-Wahabu. Al-Razaku, Al-Fatahu. Jazakallah. Okay, G4433. Uh, Any mistakes? They haven't unmuted. Can I request uh, G4417? Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. So you've listened to G4444. Did you spot any mistakes? Okay, I think G4417 isn't coming through either. That's okay. So G4444, could you recite just the first box again? Al Musawwiru. Yeah. Any any rule that you have to pay attention whilst you're reciting this word? Um thick letters, salt. Exactly. And and uh, uh, I think Before yeah, we've also got the ra, oh, which is English. carrying, yeah, which yeah. carries the dhamma. English. And in English. that case, it will be pronounced with a thick sound. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. Jazakallah. So I will hand over to the teaching assistant to go through some more practice now. Jazakallah. <laughs> Yes, so now we are going to practice Surah Bani Israel. Uh, and I would like to request the SD for a student. Uh, could I request G4422 to come on the mic, please? Jazakallah. G4422, Assalamu Alaikum. Assalamu Alaikum. Wa Alaikum Assalam wa Rahmatullah. Okay, let's start with Tabuz and Tasmiyah. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم سبحان الذي أسرى بعبده ليلا من المسجد من المسجد الهرام إلى المسجد الهرام Aksa 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 Okay, Jazakillah, G4422. Uh, so first of all, in the first line, first word, we have the big ha. Okay, so we have two types of ha. We have a big one, which comes from the middle of the throat. Okay, and then we have a small ha. So these are similar sounding letters, but we have to make sure that we differentiate in their sound. Okay, so we would say, Subhanallazi. Can you try? Okay, much better. And try to um, prolong this for more than two seconds. Okay, we have got Yamad here. Okay, 
This is Yasakin preceded by uh, a Maksur letter. Okay, but it is also carrying this stretch. Okay, medium long stretch. And we haven't covered this rule yet. Okay, but um, it should be prolonged for a minimum of three seconds. So can you try that again? Okay, and your voice is really low. So if you could come closer to your device. Okay. Yeah, that's much better. Okay. Um, secondly, here, I think you pronounced the tanmeen. So if you can carry on from asro and then continue onwards. Okay, Jazakillah, your voice again is very low. I can hardly hear it. Uh, but uh, just to remind all the students, um, the correct way to pronounce this would be Laylam al Masjid. Okay, so we are not pronouncing the Tanween. We are joining the Tanween into the Meem Mushaddad. And while we do that, we are going to make a two second nasal sound. Okay, and then um, I think um, your voice was really low, so I couldn't hear properly, but I think you changed the stroke here and here. Um, so just be careful with that, not to change any strokes, because obviously that will change the meaning of the word and then obviously the whole meaning of the verse as well. Um, here, so this is a thick letter, this off, okay? And in addition to that, it is um, it should be pronounced with a jerk, okay? With a jerking sound. So this is going to be Ilal Masjid al Aqsalazi. Try. Okay, I think that is much better. And can you say this word again? Okay, so make sure to prolong it for two seconds. Okay. Ayatina. Very good. That was much better. So each of these should be prolonged for two seconds each. Okay. Jazakillah, G4422. Can we have another student? Uh, can I request G4467 to come on the mic? G4467, assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah. Okay, let's start with Tavvas. Yes. <laughs> Okay, very good, excellent. Um, I think you pronounced this ha nicely in the first place, but yes. we have it here again. So yes. just remember. Uh, yes. Yeah. So can you try that again? Yes. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Okay. Sorry, so it just go, go, go. So you recited really well, mashallah. Um, just a few things. 
So here, um, at the end of this line, just remember to prolong this for two seconds. Okay. Yes, I think so my my uh, just uh, my breathing just I I think so. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, um, yeah, that's fine. And then here, we haven't covered this rule yet, uh, but we have to conceal the sound of noon here. So instead of min, it is going to be meoduni. So can you try that? Yes. Yes. Min do ni. Okay, much better. Jazakla G four four six seven. Can I uh, continue or? Uh, yes, you can continue. Okay. So from Zuri, is Zuriata? Yes. Okay. Zuriata man man hamal. Zuriata man hamal na maanu. Innahu kana abdan shakura. Jazakillah. Again, you recited really well. Um, one thing which we have covered is um, mud letters, okay, letters of elongation. Yeah. And the rule for them is to uh, is to prolong them for two seconds. Haruf uh, al-Mad, yeah, I forgot. Sorry. So can I try it again? Haruf yeah. al-Mad. So can you try this again? Yes. Ma'anu. Okay, much better. Um, you don't have to prolong the ain. Ma'anu. Ma'anu. Okay, much better. And then again, the same thing here. Instead of noon um, sakin, we have noon tanmeen. Okay? Yeah. But we have to conceal the sound uh, here as well, just like we did here. Yeah. Okay? It is to do with the letter that follows afterwards, but mm -hmm. I won't go into, the, uh, into detail. Mm -hmm. um, if you can just try this again. Okay, very good. And then I think you corrected um, your mistake here. Yes, yes. Yeah. So we have two words. Both of them are carrying tashdeed. Okay, so, yes. Yes. Yeah, so it can get... Um, tricky to pronounce it but um, I think you did well if you can just try it again as well yes Mommy! 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 Okay. yes that was right so Mommy! can we have another student uh, yes can I request G triple four nine to come on the mic please G triple four nine. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah. Okay, let's start with Tawuz and Tasmiya. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan al-wajim. Okay, so just one thing. Um, in Tavuz, we have um, the word shaitan, okay, and then we have the letter ta in it, which is one of the seven thick letters, okay, and we have covered the topic of tafreen. So if you can try this again and okay. make a thick sound for the letter ta. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Yes, that was much better. We can continue from here. Okay, Jazakillah. 
So first of all, in the first word, we have a thick letter. Okay. okay. Thick letter thought. So we have to be mindful of its uh, correct pronunciation. And then uh, just when you prolong, uh, be consistent. So first we have this uh, small stretch. Okay. And the rule for it is three to five seconds. So even if you prolong this for three seconds and the vertical fatha for two seconds, the listener should be able to hear the difference, right? Okay. So if you can just work on that. And then here we have yamad, okay? One of ruful mad. So remember to prolong this for two seconds. So can you try this again, this word? Yeah. Okay. What's and it? yeah, we have to prolong this for two seconds. Then okay. again, in this word, marrotaini, we have ya lean. Okay, that was yamat, and this is yalin, because the previous letter is carrying fatha this time. Okay, in this case, it was carrying kasra, mm -hmm. and in this example, it's carrying fatha. So we have to prolong it for two seconds, but this time we have to do it softly. So can you try that again? Yes, much better. And then, um, again, I I told this to the previous student as well. Here we have the mean of noon. Okay, so we have to conceal its sound. Can you try? Okay, make sure that the raw and this both are two seconds long. Okay. Okay, Jazakillah, uh, G triple four nine. Can I request the ST um, to now call on mic our guest from Al Hafizun? Yes, can I request LG one nine two two G four SM to come on the mic for Quran recitation? Assalamualaikum. Alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah. So, um, uh, would you like to recite from the start? A few verses from the start? Okay. Yes, 
إسرائيل في الكتاب لا تفسد في الأرض مرتين ولا تألن علوا كبيرا فإذا جاء وقت أولاهما بعثنا عليكم بعثنا عليكم عبادا لنا أولي بأس شديد فجاسوا حلال التجار Jazakilla. So, mashallah, you recited really well, and I'm, I hope and pray that it was a source of encouragement uh, for our, all of our G4 students, uh, and I hope that it was also encouraging for our guest as well. Uh, okay, so now we can go back and continue. taking our students could I, could I request g4432 to come on the mic g4432 assalamu alaikum G four four three two. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikum assalam. Rahmatullah. Okay, let's start with Tawuz and Tasmiya. A'uzu billahi min al-shaytan al-rajim. Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim. Okay. So. We have three ha in tasmiya. The first one is the small ha, and then the next two are big ha, which come from middle of the throat. So if you can differentiate between their sounds, and try again. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Okay, much better. Faiza, Faiza, jo awa wa du ula huma ba asna ba asna alai kum kum bima dal dalana uli ba ba sin shadi din. فَجَاسُوا خِلَالَ لَلَّدِّ يَارَ وَكَانَ وَعْدًا مَفْعُولًا Okay, Jazakillah. So, first thing that I want to mention is um, the sound of Ayn. Make sure to differentiate it from sound of Alif. Okay, and it appears quite a few times in this verse. So, um, can you try the f- first part of the verse again? Faiza, Faiza, ja awa du ula huma wa ba baas na alikum ibada. Okay. Is that okay? Or I... Yes, that's fine. Jazakallah. So you paused correctly. When we pause, this is going to be Just remember to prolong it for a bit longer. Okay. Okay, for two seconds. Jazakallah. The second thing is okay. that we are going to uh, conceal the sound of Noon mm-hmm. Tanveen here. Ba'seon Shadeedon. Try. 
Okay, the sound of noon should not be uh, manifested. Okay? So, there is going to be a slight nasal sound, soft nasal sound, but the sound of noon, noon is not going to be manifested. Okay? So, you can work on that. Uh, and then at the end as well, you paused correctly. Just remember to prolong it for a bit longer. Mafrula. Mafrula. Yes, that was much better. So we have vaumad here. Okay. And then when we pause here, this will become alif mad. So we have to prolong each of these for two seconds. Okay, Jazakillah, G4432. Can we have another student? Uh, can I request G4435 to come on the mic? G4435, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Okay, let's start with Tavuz and Tasmiya. A'uzu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem Bismillahir rahmanir rahim Okay so make sure that the ra the sound of ra is thick okay we are going to pronounce it with the fim here in this case okay and here as well so, can you try that again? Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Okay. And make sure to work on the sound of ha as well. Okay. We have to differentiate between these two um, letters. Okay. We can continue from here. Summa radadna lakumul qarrata alayhim Alayhim wa amdadna kum bi amwanim wa baneen Wa baneen wa ja'alna kum aqsara nafira Okay, very good. Yes, sorry, yeah, I think it's... <laughs> Yes, that's okay. So, of, okay. Yeah. So you can try from Wajalna Kum and Wajalna Kum Aksarana Fira. Very good. That was much better. So we are prolonging the Yamad and then at the end, because we are pausing, we are going to prolong the Alif for two seconds as well. Um, just in terms of the correct. Um, sound of the letters you have to um, the letter th, this letter it has a vibrating sound okay Com compared to the letter seen sa has a vibrating sound so can you try this again Thum. Thum. okay and the sound of letter ain as well him Jazakallah. So here we have Yaleen, which you prolonged for two seconds. So that's good. And then here, uh, Can you try? Yes. So make sure to do a two second nasal sound here when we merge uh, the tanween into the vaw mushaddad we have to do a two second nasal sound uh, jazakillah g4435 now i'm going to hand over to the dt jazakillah All right, so yeah, we are now coming towards the end of our class. Uh, Jazak Mullah and well done to all students. Please ensure that you keep practicing all the rules learned so far in the course in your free time. Uh, so you're ready for the next classes, inshallah. Uh, Jazak Mullah to all students for joining this class today. 
and also the whole teaching team. Jazakumullah, assalamu alaikum, wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.